Welcome to Glory Zone Channel, a place where God's Word resides richly. Do not forget to like, share, and subscribe to this YouTube channel as we take the gospel of Christ around the world. Glory to God. Do not forget to subscribe. Psalm 26 by David, the prayer of an innocent person. Show that I am right, Lord. I stay true to myself, and I have trusted you without doubting. Test my thoughts and find out what I am like. I never forget your kindness, and I am always faithful to you. I don't spend my time with worthless liars or go with evil crowds. I wash my hands, Lord, to show my innocence, and I worship at your altar while gratefully singing about your wonders. I love the temple where you live and where your glory shines. Don't sweep me away as you do sinners. Don't punish me with death as you do those people who are brutal or full of meanness or who bribe others. I stay true to myself. Be kind and rescue me. Now, I stand on solid ground, and when your people meet, I will praise you, Lord. Psalm 27 by David, a prayer of praise. You, Lord, are the light that keeps me safe. I am not afraid of anyone. You protect me, and I have no fears. Brutal people may attack and try to kill me, but they will stumble. Fierce enemies may attack, but they will fall. Armies may surround me, but I won't be afraid. War may break out, but I will trust you. I ask only one thing, Lord. Let me live in your house every day of my life to see how wonderful you are and to pray in your temple. In times of trouble, you will protect me. You will hide me in your tent and keep me safe on top of a mighty rock. You will let me defeat all of my enemies. Then I will celebrate as I enter your tent with animal sacrifices and songs of praise. Please listen when I pray. Have pity. Answer my prayer. My heart tells me to pray. I am eager to see your face, so don't hide from me. I am your servant, and you have helped me. Don't turn from me in anger. You alone keep me safe. Don't reject or desert me. Even if my father and mother should desert me, you will take care of me. Teach me to follow, Lord, and lead me on the right path because of my enemies. Don't let them do to me what they want. People tell lies about me and make terrible threats, but I know I will live to see how kind you are. Trust the Lord. Be brave and strong and trust the Lord. Psalm 28 by David, a prayer for help. Only you, Lord, are a mighty rock. Don't refuse to help me when I pray. If you don't answer me, I will soon be dead. Please, listen to my prayer and my cry for help as I lift my hands toward your holy temple. Don't drag me away, Lord, with those cruel people who speak kind words while planning trouble. Treat them as they deserve. Punish them for their sins. They don't pay any attention to your wonderful deeds. Now you will destroy them and leave them in ruin. I praise you, Lord, for answering my prayers. You are my strong shield, and I trust you completely. 
You have helped me, and I will celebrate and thank you in song. You give strength to your people, Lord, and you save and protect your chosen ones. Come, save us and bless us. Be our shepherd and always carry us in your arms. Psalm 29, a psalm by David, the voice of the Lord in a storm. All of you angels in heaven, honor the glory and power of the Lord. Honor the wonderful name of the Lord and worship the Lord most holy and glorious. The voice of the Lord echoes over the oceans. The glorious Lord God thunders above the roar of the raging sea, and His voice is mighty and marvelous. The voice of the Lord destroys the cedar trees. The Lord shatters cedars on Mount Lebanon. God makes Mount Lebanon skip like a calf and Mount Hermon jump like a wild ox. The voice of the Lord makes lightning flash and the desert tremble. And because of the Lord, the desert near Kadesh shivers and shakes. The voice of the Lord makes deer give birth before their time. Forests are stripped of leaves, and the temple is filled with shouts of praise. The Lord rules on his throne, king of the flood forever. Pray that our Lord will make us strong and give us peace. Psalm 30 a psalm by David for the dedication of the temple, a prayer of thanks. I will praise you, Lord. You saved me from the grave and kept my enemies from celebrating my death. I prayed to you, Lord God, and you healed me, saving me from death and the grave. Your faithful people, Lord, will praise you with songs and honor your holy name. Your anger lasts a little while, but your kindness lasts for a lifetime. At night we may cry, but when morning comes, we will celebrate. I was carefree and thought, I'll never be shaken. You, Lord, were my friend, and you made me strong as a mighty mountain. But when you hid your face, I was crushed. I prayed to you, Lord, and in my prayer I said, What good will it do you if I am in the grave? Once I have turned to dust, how can I praise you or tell how loyal you are? Have pity, Lord. Help! You have turned my sorrow into joyful dancing. No longer am I sad and wearing sackcloth. I thank you from my heart, and I will never stop singing your praises, my Lord and my God.